हेलो स्टूडेंट्स हेलो ऑल वेलकम बैक टू अवर यूट्यूब बी टू बी क्लासेस ऑनलाइन चैनल ओके सो लेट्स कंटिन्यू वेर बिलेप वी वर डिस्कसिंग द फिफ्थ पॉइंट मॉनिटरिंग एंड ट्यूनिंग परफॉर्मेंस सो इन दिस पार्ट आई हैव टॉट यू टू लाइक मॉनिटर एनी लक्स एडमिन शुड मॉनिटर द डिस्क स्पेस एंड द सेकेंड मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट इज प्रोसेस मॉनिटरिंग सो आई शो यू हाउ इट वर्क ओके सो दिस वॉज द पार्ट थ्रू डी एफ कमांड we can check the disk usage or the admin should check the disk usage and should schedule a script to like um, continuously check if it's uh, reaches beyond uh, the limit uh, we should be alerted through mail through sms or something like that this is the duty of an admin or and the second part process monitoring through top command in linux you can check the processes as of now you can see everything is quiet and no much load in my machine see this is the total memory total so have space utilization only 4% of my cpu is utilized okay and see uh, if if there is a load uh, i'll get to know which user and which uh, users which command is utilizing my memory see here memory cpu this is this memory the cpu memory cpu uh, how much percentage uh, it is uh, like uh, using the resource that command so accordingly i can uh, suppose if a user or a student or or someone is like uh, um, downloading games on through multiple windows uh, so that will uh, uh, use more and more resource right so uh, in this way uh, i'll get to know the user name from this the here the user uh, suppose the user name is rohit so i'll get to know the rohit is uh, launching chrome multiple times to download games so the rohit will be caught and admin will like uh, kill his terminal or act accordingly or like block him or something like that so this is the way user admin should monitor and tune performance what do you mean by tune performance tune performance means there there are scripts executed by users uh, in machines uh, suppose which may use unnecessary unnecessary commands uh, Uh, which are not needed uh, or uh, there might be a better way to execute that uh, execute or like to define that same script so tuning that script can help uh, reducing the load on the linux machine so that uh, also comes under the linux admins bucket so these are the two most important thing according to me and this point actually leads to automation which admin can do and go far ahead of his job okay so that's it uh, this is the sixth point configuring a sec secure system this is the last point okay so in this point what we need to check uh, configuring a secure system secure system means a linux machine offer multiple services such as nfs samba ftp ssh so these services are on ports so uh, if these services are there available so there are ports open so if there are ports open there are vulnerabilities like your machine can be hacked or the hackers can check or like uh, go in your system so we need to make sure admin needs to make sure unnecessary ports uh, uh, should not be kept open if they are not used they should be closed this is the main and important task of an linux admin apart from that firewall should be configured accordingly uh, the uh, uh, the firewall should check uh, from which port from which gateway or from which ip the packets and data is coming if you are connected to an internet so firewall plays an important role and this firewalls needs to be configured and continuously checked by linux admin so this is the thing and only securing your system is not the right thing Uh, so uh, suppose uh, my machine is connected to <coughs> more five machines so uh, linux admin needs to make sure those five machines are also like good in health those um, machines are like ports are unnecessary uh, ports are uh, kept um, blocked and services are stopped if they are not used so this makes an proper uh, use of the firewall so it's quite complex like uh, to properly manage a linux machine but that's uh, the duty of an admin so uh, using a firewall in proper way can make a linux machine secure especially when this machine is exposed to internet okay uh, these are the duty of administration this is what i explained you is mentioned here <coughs> 
last point which is quite important uh, uh suppose you do something and think like your machine is very secure today it may be true but you don't know that setting works for tomorrow or not so you need to continuously check the upcoming updates and the technologies so you should be linux admin should be like up to date with the technologies to make his machine or his system like uh, error prone and attack prone so that's it guys thank you thank you for watching the video do like and subscribe our channel b2b classes